There's open admission. Everybody can get in. Nobody cares what your race, your background, your orientation, your income is. The curriculum is flexible. It changes all the time to meet the demands of the economy. People can be educated for success. They can live here and go further in education, or they can leave here and get a job. This is the way America should work. Nobody gives up their disagreements. I've been through a lot of arguments here every morning. But everybody listens to everybody else, and a community can be created, and we can go forward together. This has been an unusual election, and I think it's important to point out why. First, there are a lot of people who still feel very alienated because 80% of the American people haven't had a pay raise since the crash. Second, there are a lot of young people who, as the governor said, feel alienated because they think they can't afford college, or if they do, they'll have debt they can't repay. And finally, there are a lot of people who actually believe the central argument of Hillary's opponent's campaign that both parties are equally to blame, that nothing ever makes a difference, and you got to throw everybody out and start all over again. I don't believe that. And I'd like to tell you why, and why I think Hillary should be president. In 400 years, we have 400 years of evidence. There is not one single solitary country in 400 years that ever went through the kind of financial crash we went through that got over it in less than 10 years. 